Forget Will and Jada. Forget Jay and Beyonce and Brad and Angelina. Dave Chappelle and Netflix have the strongest relationship in all of show business. And Dave Chappelle just released a new special over the holidays. So let's talk about it. What we're not going to talk about is how I was eating Chick-fil-A right before I started recording and left the Chick-fil-A sauce right there in plain view to the point where I cannot unsee it. But like I said, we're not going to talk about that. And when it comes to the funny factor, this one is par for the course. Dave has reached a level to where he's put out so many specials on Netflix at this point where he's starting to get into a rhythm. And part of being in a rhythm is that aspects of it start to become repetitive. And that's not to say the jokes aren't funny. It's just that in earlier specials, we got a combination. There was well-constructed and well-delivered jokes coupled with a surprise or shock factor. We would, we would hear things that we would be so surprised that someone so high profile would say on stage blended with the well-constructed and well-delivered jokes that it was a nice, you know, beautiful balance. But now the shock factor is gone. We know what he's going to talk about and we know pretty much how far he's going to go. So now we're just left with well-constructed and well-delivered jokes, which is still incredibly skillful. And this special is still leagues above the next man special. But when you set the bar at the top, it's very easy to fall short. There were exceptions though, because he did address the Will Smith and Chris Rock incidents, which th addressing it was expected, but he took it in a direction I didn't expect. And he came at it from an angle I didn't anticipate. So in that sense, it was funny and surprising, but the downfall of that is that that was the exception. So it just highlighted how predictable the rest of the special was.